I'm very delighted to be here today, uh, specifically to give back to the game of basketball. Having been a former player, basketball player, and a great fan to date, it is important that those of us who are privileged to be holding positions in the public sector help to identify and nurture talent. That is why we are here as Eliud Owalo Foundation in partnership with Copbank, Rentco, Coca-Cola, Lake Basin Development Authority, the Kenya Basketball Federation, and several other sponsors to help us in identifying and nurturing basketball talent that is resident within our youth. Talent is good, but it is only good if it is nurtured and fully exploited. Our history is awash with examples of very, very, very good talent in our youth which goes to waste because it is not nurtured, mentored to a logical conclusion. And that is why we are trying as much as possible to support sports activities, as Eliud Owalo Foundation, sports activities so that we can help the youth of this country to fully exploit their potential. We have been doing it in soccer, we, want to, we are also doing it in basketball, and we will go to other sports. I want to encourage the young boys and girls who will have the opportunity to play today to take advantage of this tournament because it may be the stepping tone, stone for you to the Hall of Fame. We have here scouts from Kenya Basketball Federation. We have got scouts from the Kenya Academy of Sports who will identify good talent courtesy of this tournament who will win sponsorship, basketball sponsorship to overseas countries. So please do your best during the games so that you get the opportunity to be part of the few who will be selected uh, for the scholarship. We are holding this tournament in various uh, venues. We have Maseno School is just one of them. Kenyatta Sports Ground is another. Kisumu Girls is another venue, and Kisumu Boys as well, as well. So in total, we have a total of 26 schools taking part in this tournament. And these are actually the top schools in Nyanza, covering all the six counties of Nyanza. So the best basketball talent in schools is participating in this tournament. I want to challenge the organizers who are here, who are reputable, former players, people who made a mark in sports and played for the national team in the 80s and 90s, to take advantage of this tournament also to help us identify some good talents who can constitute a basketball team to be resident here in Nyanza, more specifically Kisumu. When we were young, we had got two very strong basketball teams in Kisumu. One of them was called Lakers, another one was called Juakali. Ronnie Owino here was a player for Juakali, and even more is Aduana. And the backbone of the Kenya national basketball team was players from Kisumu, or from Nyanza for that matter. So please, let us at the end of this tournament select a few of these boys and girls, so that we have at least two strong teams from Nyanza. A girls basketball team and a boys basketball team competing in the top league, basketball leagues at some point in time. As a foundation, we are ready and willing to sponsor those two teams. A girls team and a boys, a boys team. So that we can take basketball back to where it was. I was so disappointed that St. Mary's Yala, where I was a player, and also Cardinal Otunga are not participating in this team because they are not among the top schools in basketball in Nyanza. What defined basketball in Nyanza during our days when I was a student here at Maseno School was the rivalry between Kisumu Boys, Cardinal Otunga, St. Mary's Yala, Maseno School, just to mention but a few. 
Mosocho Cardinal was in its element when it came to basketball. Honi Orino here is a product of, of, of Mosocho Cardinal. And it just shows you how credible the selection process for this tournament was. Because my own former school where I did A-level St. Mary's Yala has missed out. Ronnie Owino's own school, Cardinal Otunga, has missed out in participating in this tournament. <laughs> so we have taken credibility and integrity to another level. We did not vote for them because we went to those schools. So that is what um, we mean when we say that uh, we, 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 people need to participate in sports tournament on merit. Now, the Kenya Basketball Federation is also partnering with us, and I want to thank the Federation most sincerely for their support. They have also sent scouts here who will help identify good talent. We have before had talent from schools making it all the way to the national basketball teams. So perhaps from this tournament again, we may end up with a few boys and girls who will get their way to both the Lioness, as it is called, the, basket, the ladies uh, national basketball team, and the Morans, uh, the men's basketball team. Otherwise, we wish you a good game. Maseno versus Sonjiko, we want to watch a good game. May the best team win in all the other subsequent matches. Also, may the best teams win. The girls, please, get your space in basketball. We are here to watch good games. Tomorrow, we will all converge at the Kenyatta Sports Ground in Kisumu to watch the semi-finals and the, the finals. And we will have also the awards ceremony, the award ceremony. We have a total of 390 students taking part in this tournament. Everybody is going to come out of this tournament a winner. So it is a win-win situation for all of us who are participating in this tournament. Otherwise, we look forward to a good game between Maseno and Ojeko. May the best team win. Let's go.